Okay, well, I'm, I'm here with Pete Ellie. Is it Ellie? Ely. Ely. Pete Ely. And he's going to talk about a little bit of sports orientated stuff, particularly adventure. Well, over to you, Pete. What, what is it? Oh, well, we run a two year deployment now in adult leadership and management. And today we're running a small upsell here off the D block for the tertiary open day. So we run a two year course that culminates in whitewater kayaking, sea kayaking, climbing and just general outdoor stuff and then the second year is on to uh, more learning how to actually teach the skills that you learned in the first year so that's uh, what we run here. That sounds like a bloody great course actually. It is, it is a bloody great course. You say skiing? Oh uh, we do as part of the school adventure we run three ski programs up in Wanaka yeah. so ski and snowboard instructor courses with the avalanche one option if you decide to take the course or not and so we run those two, oh, three, three courses up in Wanaka. So. I'm just wondering just off there, um, given that uh, New Zealand's Southern Hemisphere, do you ever take students from the Northern Hemisphere to then go back into the season on the North or something like that? Has that ever happened? Um, more that people have come to live in New Zealand and yeah, done the course uh, rather than actually yeah, yeah. try to do a course here and then gone back. We've yeah. had a couple, I think, that have that have done the course from New Zealand and then gone away to work in the Northern Hemisphere for the, the ski seasons after that. But And uh, do you guys go kayaking in the winter? Uh, we do, yes. Jesus. <laughs> I wouldn't want to be a student then. Oh, it's not, it's not too bad, yeah. you know. All the all the gear and all the rest of it, you stay it's fairly warm. warm. Okay. Yeah, so it's not yeah. too bad. And the rivers are pretty raging, so you keep pretty oh, active. This is true, yep. yeah. yeah. <laughs> what, what other, in the Sports Institute generally, what other courses we must be going over to this guy here? Yeah, we are, we're, this is Gary, he's going to talk about the other courses. Gary, today. Good day. Uh, yeah, I'm Gary. Uh, I'm from the Sports Institute. Um, what do we do? We do diploma in sports studies, uh, um, certificate in personal training, exercise prescription, um, and diploma in uh, sport management and coaching. Oh, okay. Yep. What's, and apart from coaching, which is pretty obvious, what other type of work would you go into when uh, you do these sort of courses? Well, I don't know what teachers are called here in high in school. In terms of uh, sport management and coaching, yeah. um, there's quite a lot of um, sports coordinator type jobs going on at high schools oh, yeah, yeah. nowadays, a lot of that sort of thing. Um, students have also been employed with uh, regional sports organisations, the yeah. likes of uh, Sport Otago for example, mm. those sorts of things, yeah. And do you train up athletes here? Yeah, yeah, with the Diploma in Sporting Performance um, we're working quite closely with athletes trying to um, develop their individual sporting performances right. and we can team them up with um, sport specific coaches mm. to help um, students work on certain aspects of their of their performance. Uh, we're also looking at um, strength training and conditioning. Mm. Um, pretty broad sort of spectrum trying to develop all their skills and knowledge in a variety of areas. So yeah we got the training, conditioning, we've got nutrition, mm. sports psychology, biomechanics, those sorts of things as well. What sort of facilities do you have for this sort of thing? Uh, in terms of facilities, well obviously we've got the Sports Institute over here. Um, That's got like lecture theatres? Yeah, and like we've yep. got a, our main sort of lecture theatre but we're also encompassing um, other lecture theatres throughout the Polytech as well. Um, we have quite close ties with uh, Unipol Sports Centre as well and uh, World Gym. World Gym, yep. Uh, yep, and also down at the Sports Academy and the Caledonian ground, the students spend quite a bit of time down there. We've also got the hockey turf just across the road as well. Okay. So yeah, with um, making pretty good use of all the yeah, all like facilities that. around the area. Yep. Thanks very much, Gary. No worries. Yep.